Hey guys, it's SPW. Welcome back to Let's Play Yoshi Story Bone Dragon Pit Go. Yes, um... Welcome to attempt number who knows what, because I actually... <laughs> screwed up and lost a chance at a melon. And it was just not going very well at all. Um, I'll show you actually... I'll show you the exact spot where I screwed up is actually not too far away from here, and I'll be sure not to mess it up this time. Um, these guys are no threat at all. You couldn't even see them, but you'll see them in a little bit. They just shoot fireballs at you, but two hits with an egg or two ground pounds make short work of them. Okay. I accidentally hit that one with an egg, and it fell in the pit, and I kept leaving like the area and coming back and hoping it would respawn, but it did not, so... Yeah. Um, oh yeah, I was gonna talk about this strange habit. Strange habit I have with this game, which is the order in which I pick the colored Yoshis. I always pick them in a certain order, and that's green, pink, dark blue, yellow, red, and then light blue. And that is only because I have, like, um, a player's guide for this game, which shows you where everything is, and the chapters are laid out with, like, the way the, um, chapters of the guide are laid out. Don't, don't miss that coin, thank you. And e each chapter has, like, a special color Yoshi, um, assigned to it, I guess you could say. And I've always just done it like this. I don't know, it, it's just, just one of those weird OCD things I have. I'm, I'm kind of OCD with everything. I'm not completely OCD with this game, like, I'm not, like, there are, like, specific high scores you can get, like, getting every single coin. I'm not doing that. That would be way too much. Like, I'm gonna go for all melons, gonna go for all hearts, gonna go for all, like, the secret coin letters, that crap, but every single coin? No, you have to, like, do this thing where you sniff out and find secret things and every single place, and I mean, I know, I like, I guess I wouldn't have to do that, because I do have the guide for it, and that tells you where everything is, too, but still, that would just be really tedious. But anyway, while I was talking about coins, I killed a giant evil death thing. Well, I mean, it, it was dead. More like a giant... I killed a dead thing. Oh, man. The undead. Oh, man. Let's get some eggs over here. Drop down here, don't kill- okay, thank god. Thank god. See, I guess when there's like just these easy groups of coins like just lying out- well, bleh, lying out here, I'll get them. But other than that... What the crap? Onion guy, freaking, freaking get it. Freaking knocked my egg away. Are you kidding me? Did I really miss another one? Oh, I know where it is. No, 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 no. I can, I can salvage this. I can salvage this. It's right here, isn't it? Yeah, it is. There we go. Okay, good. Good, I don't have to freaking start over. Oh, yeah, and then this actually works out because there's freaking coins here. I don't know why that heart was all... Actually, I guess I got some of this. I don't, I don't know what happened. Basically... You get your 12th melon here, which gives you a heart, but then all the coins are over there. So... I don't know, so that worked out in the end. In, in fact... That's how I planned it, I... I swear. I swear to God. Um, if memory serves correctly... Serves correct... Uh, whatever, words... There's nothing in here, is there? Nothing. Useless room. Useless room is useless. That sounds like a freaking meme, I don't know. I don't know. Out of eggs. Great. Great. I also have another thing where, like, I'm kind of OCD about <laughs> the color of the, of, um, uh, the eggs that I have. Like, I like to have them all just the one color, um, of my Yoshi, which is kind of stupid. Like, I probably will try and not do that just for, um, uh, just for convenience sake during the videos just because I don't want to like waste your guys' time like making sure all my eggs are the exact same color but 
like, when I'm just, like, playing this to myself, um, I go out of my way, like, not to eat certain Shy Guys in certain colors. And basically that means that I can't eat any Shy Guys when I'm pink or light blue Yoshi, because there are no pink or light blue Shy Guys, which I thought was kind of weird. Kind of weird. There are even, like, black Shy Guys and, um, uh, white Shy Guys, which are actually good serve as, um, one-ups, but probably not going to be seeing those, because I don't want to... I'm probably not going to let any Yoshis die, and by that I mean if I die, I'll freaking just reset, just because of the way I... Again, OCD, the way I do the whole color thing. I don't want to, like... That, and I don't want to, um... run out of Yoshis, because then it's game over, and then you have to start over, and... I don't want to do that. No Surrey Bob. Um, this is some weird mini game thing, I don't know, but I always like before I do this, I always like to go ahead and make sure the entire path is clear. Otherwise that would have been just I mean like it's not like it would have been in like oh, like really that hard, but I don't know. I'm 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 extra cautious with a lot of these things. A bit too cautious. But this is, you just kind of like have to balance it. There we go. So the start and the jump. And run and tally ho, tally ho. Goal, melons, happy. And I think we're getting another, we're getting, Gurton. We are getting. This video brought to you by the letter R. It's freaking Sesame Street or whatever. I think that was. Yeah, that was the one. That was the one. She's the one. I don't know. Okay, this part right here. This is just... This is dumb. Okay, so basically... Yeah, there's this thing where you go like this. And you can find hidden places. And then when Yoshi goes like that, you can jump. And do a ground pound and find something. But you come to this spot. It's a white spot like all the other spots. Um, why isn't anything happening? One spot, I'm pretty sure, in the entire game. You throw an egg instead. I don't... I just don't understand why... I don't understand why. Oh, also, when you, um, uh... When you have, like, the super happy heart fruit of joy, you have unlimited eggs, so you can also... You can actually, like, get ready to throw in and cancel it, and then you can just generate eggs, so now I have six eggs without even having to... to go anywhere and find an egg block or anything. 27... 28. Did I get this one over here? Don't tell me I'm missing it. Oh, no. Okay. Good. Good. Thank God. I would have been just, like, enraged. Because I want to... I want to... The same thing with uh, Pikmin. I want to, like, make this efficient. I don't want to be... Wait, did I... This is the one I need to get. Um, we're not getting it yet because we have a couple extra things to get because we still need to get a heart. And we need to go up here and get this. This is a really weird thing. Eat this flower, and then you turn into an egg that can launch itself, and then you can get to places. <gasps> a giant black egg! What could possibly be in this... <laughs> um, what was I talking about? Oh yeah, um, I like to be efficient with these, because again... These videos are... This isn't like a live thing or whatever, you know? This is... These things are just gonna be up. And then... I don't know, they're gonna be up, so it's like, might as well give your all, so I'm gonna try and make this efficient as possible. Like, if I mess up a little bit, like, kind of like I already did, it's okay, because I just had to go back, and it actually helped me, because I found secret hidden coins! Woo! And now I only have... Yeah, I guess you have to do the ground pound thing here, because they only give you, um, so many eggs. You can only have six eggs. You... Oh, God. Ah, I got... I got pulled into him, and then I bounced out, because it's glitchy as crap. <gasps> okay, no, 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 I need, I need to eat. Flower. Eat the flower. Eat the flower, yeah, they don't... When you have the, the big Yoshi egg, actually, um, uh, the black Yoshi egg, actually takes up a spot. So, you, like, when you have, like, this or another item or something that follows you around, then... Yeah, you can only have five eggs, so you'd have to know the ground pound thing either way. So it's a good thing that's possible. Otherwise, this part of the game would be impossible, and I don't like it when things in games are impossible. I actually can't think of anything, because that would just be terribly designed, but then again, I've never played 
Superman 64 or Sonic 06, so... I wouldn't know. What was I... Oh, yeah. One thing I just kind of wanted to... that just kind of popped into my brain. And it's kind of... This is kind of a, a sad... A sad little point to make. But because of my whole liking to do things efficiently... Um... Attitude with these things... You're probably never going to see any sort of thing having to do with Donkey Kong 64 ever because it's that game is impossible to do efficiently or at least I can't I can't find a way to do it I don't know maybe Slim Kirby did I don't know I know Slim Kirby did that game twice but I couldn't I just couldn't I'm just gonna stick with the things I know because I mean I played that game before but even with like a guide like an internet guide it is so I've talked about this already. I've t <laughs> I've talked about this in a freaking Pikmin video. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, it's time for heart recaps. Blarg's giving us hearts. As they continue to look for happiness, the Yoshi's got lost in a dark cave. This isn't your average everyday darkness. This is advanced darkness. Inside lived Bone Dragon. If the Yoshi stayed, they'd surely be eaten. They escaped, of course. No Yoshi wants to become lunch for a dragon. Even though the dragons don't eat you, they just breathe fire at you. The page turned, and the Yoshis grew happier. There actually is a thing in this game that, um, uh... Eats you. We're gonna be getting to that later. It's terrible. But we're not getting into that for a little while. I don't know, I I've still got time. I've got time! Anyway, um... Next time we're going to be doing cloud cruising on page 3, the summit. Um, kind of a nice change from evil looking, it goes happy then evil then happy, or at least not evil looking again. I don't know. It's nice. It's nice. I like this world. It's fun. Although it can be annoying too. All the worlds can be fun and annoying, except for the first one. That one is just easy. Anyways, I'm dragging this on. Thank you for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye. I'm terrible at goodbyes.